come on in. Let's go make a shake. Right, my throat is sore. It's not sore, sore, sore. It's just sore. Every time I swallow, these here hurt. So I've got a cold shake. Now this is cappuccino. I haven't put no extra coffee in it, but I have put some skinny food uh, syrup, whatever it's called. You know, the the skinny food, the the whatever it's called. Anyway, it's salted caramel sugar-free syrup. Oh. Oh, I quite like that. Yes, you don't need extra coffee in that. You just need a bit of skinny food syrup or whatever it's called. you do that's a freaking amazing so nice on throw it's there it's them marbles in your throat the hurt. Anyway, I have woke up, it's nine o'clock. Well, it's half nine now. I've been messing about, I've put some washing on. But the sun is shining. Shining! It looks like it's gonna be a good day. So I might be able to get the garden cooked. Not me, Isabel. And get it, and get it somewhat decent. Because we cut it because it was too long and Scarlett just blew, well she didn't blow, she just smoked the lawnmower. But because it's short and now it's dried, I'm hoping that we can get a quick cut on it for it to look decent. That's what we're probably gonna do today. But first of all, I am gonna go and enjoy my cappuccino shake. Good morning, everybody. And welcome back to Easter Sunday. The clocks have gone forward. It's 22 minutes past 11. So it's 22 minutes past 10. So I am going to have my breakfast. Very, very late on in day. This is chocolate shake with hazelnut mm. spot on i can't have no more because i've got to go and have my tablets but it is easter sunday i hope everybody has had a chocolate easter egg i've got my chocolate easter egg it's my shake uh not not really i don't i don't have a chocolate easter egg on easter sunday uh, I had one for last night I had war 2017 potentially I think <sighs> on Easter Sunday uh, I'm not saying I've not had chocolate because I do I have had chocolate not since I've been starting on this like but I have had chocolate in the past uh, but that's all stopped now because we are shaky shaky it uh, so yeah so i'm having this i've got to have my tablets this looks a little bit thick today oh, it's so nice on throat my 
My throat is a little bit so still a little bit sore when swallowing. Like I'm gonna have a look at my, my bit of tonsils that I've got that I can see. When I get a sore throat, I just get a sore throat. It's like swallowing glass. But when Jamie gets a sore throat, he gets a sore throat and his tonsils just swell to the dangly thing in the middle. And he really, really, really struggles with tonsillitis. So does Scarlett and so does Isabel. They have all taken after Jamie. Whereas I've just got a very, very, very sore throat to the point where swallowing hurts. Uh, changing weather, a little bit sniffly. Anybody else sniffle when weather changes? Like, I used to get a cold in spring. I used to get a cold in autumn and winter. That's the three times that I get a cold. And I've had colds, don't get me wrong but not like I used to get a cold, whereas I'd be really, really, really like bunged up for like over a week or so. Whereas now I just feel like I've <sighs> constantly got a runny nose. Could be a fever, who knows? Uh, a sore throat and like coughing but not coughing, coughing, if you know what I mean. Like, laying flat, I can cough because I'm laid flat, I'm not sat up. This shoulder has gave me some right jip in the night. Uh, like, it's it's really sore to move it today. Uh, to a point where I was gonna Google what is the best thing for shoulder pain. Like, even it's even on the shoulder 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 here like ear's not hurting as much but here on the shoulder on the bone oh that hurt every bit at night and i tell i had to sleep if i were laid on my back i had to sleep with my arm up like this i couldn't hold it straight uh if i laid on my side i had to have it up over my shoulder so this bone didn't oh it's, it's a me it's a right mess uh, so I'm going to have my tablets I'm going to have my shake I'm going to let some light into the bedroom because yeah. it's Easter and I'm going to put House of Sims on that's what I'm going to do for a couple of hours and maybe have a painkiller for this shoulder. Like I've had rub on it, I've had uh, pad things on it that you can stick on your shoulder. I've, I've, I've done everything, I don't know. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sit, watch House of Sims, have my tablets, drink my drink, and I'll see you in a bit. Morning. I'm just going to go with floor. That's all I can say. Update on throat. Still the same. Hurts when I swallow. I've been a maiden vanilla and caramel shot, hot shot, beanico. So good on throat. Anyway, I haven't been around much this weekend. It's been a long weekend, as we call it. Oh. Because basically, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, yeah, for us is all bank holidays type of thing. Uh, <coughs> Last time you saw me was Friday and Saturday, Sunday, 
and today, Monday, I'm just like, I ain't moving. It's raining outside, it's pissing, pissing it down. It's been nice for a couple of days. <coughs> Probably the reason why Michelle is like getting the sniffle. I've had to have my Ventolin at night because I, I was coughing that much. Anyway, me and Scarlett sat and watched Loaded in Paradise yesterday. First five episodes. On ITVX. First season's already on. It's amazing. It's funny. It's laughable. It's crazy. It's it's good. Uh, so I am going to find something to watch. I'm going to have my tablets. I'm going to watch something. I'm going to get showered. Uh, yeah basically that's it we're having beef stew today uh, because I ain't going out to shops for salad stuff and it's cold so I thought I could have a beef stew bowl just with beef stew carrots just a couple of potatoes uh, you know, and just and that's that's basically what I'm having uh, for t for tonight's tea, and just have a small ball of a small ball of that. Now I had a chicken salad yesterday for my din tea for my for my food as a, as we can call it. I think they're up while late because the clock's going forward, so everything went quiff basically. So yesterday I had three products. I had a shake at morning. I had my salad. Well, I didn't even get up well half past, 12, half past 11. I had a shake at morning. I had my salad, chicken salad at tea time. And then supper time, I had my porridge. I didn't have no after that. I had three products yesterday. Uh, do, do I know about it today? Yes, I am hungry. It is. Five to ten. <clears throat> I woke up about quarter past nine, coughing. So I ended up having some more ventilin. Uh, <clears throat> so I'm going to go and enjoy this, have my tablets, put something on telly, and I will check in with you all in a bit. Right, I have just had a shower. Exfoliated. My skin is smooth because I've put some scrub on basically as you do just can't get rid of this in fact I'll tell you what I'll do I will put some of this on it to see if I can get it down anyway that's that so I have just had an email for all his contact details for in resort. <laughs> so everything that we've like, it's got Jamie's number, Jamie's email, my number, my email. Uh, Jamie's the first contact for if they need to get in contact with us in resort etc etc so all that's been done uh, can't wait there is other things that we've got to do uh, we have got to print off all as uh, documents we've got to print scan and print as passports we've got to print off as at all we've to print off as insurance uh, what else have we to print off and I'm only taking it because I'm taking it just in case my phone runs out of battery if you know what I mean which it won't because I've got a battery pack that I'm going to take and the phone will be charged up fully before leaving the resort uh, basically so I will keep a 
plug in my hand luggage coming home so I can plug my phone in to charge it up. Uh, what else? I've got to take a, a... I don't know what it's called. We have a fast charging plug. Like that via that black thing. And I've stuck mine down. And I really shouldn't have because I can take that with us. Because it's got two C's and it's got uh, the big ones. And I'm taking my fan, neck fan. I'm taking my earphones. I'm presuming Jamie will be taking his earphones. Jamie's got a phone charger to take. I've got my phone charger to take. Uh, so yeah, so that's, that's what we've got to take roughly. It's all getting real. Oh dear, I think I need some calms. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's like, I can basically say I go away next month. You know what I mean? It's very, 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 not very, 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 very close, but it's very, very, very close. So I'm going to go through the cases with Jamie. He's going to have his dinner, but I'm going to go through cases because I'm taking a case for me, a case for Jamie. Jamie's taking a hand luggage, I'm taking a hand luggage, but I'm also taking a bag for airport, not airport, for hotel. And then that bag's going to stay in car. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that in car. That's a that's a tip uh, from Sugar Babe. She she said that instead of having everything in your bag, just take an extra bag and leave that bag in case in car. Which we are taking a car now, so I can do that. I don't have to have a lot of stuff in my hand luggage. I can just have the electricity electric stuff. Jamie's got his what you call it, and I'm putting some clothes. Uh, just in case the cases get get lost, but I have got apple tags on my on my cases. Uh, I don't know whether to put apple tags on my hand luggages, but my hand luggage is going to be with me all the time. So it's not like it's going to go missing because it's going to be it's going to be in front of us basically. Uh, yeah, that's that's what we're doing. I'm sure that's an unluggish case. I'm positive, it's an unluggish case. In fact, I am going to go on website, and I'm going to see size sizes that you can have for an unluggish case, because I've paid extra for an unluggage case. Uh, you get twenty two kilos, but then I've paid an extra whatever it were for two hand luggages so I've got a little hand luggage Jamie's got an hand luggage but Jamie's also got a bag with his machine in now if we can get that in a case we then don't have to carry that but I don't want that to go missing if case goes missing so I'd rather him carry it do you see where I'm going I am looking at the stuff just to put in my head what I've got to do so when he's had his dinner, I'm going to sort it all out. Very weird having to use this ring light because I have to shut the curtains, otherwise you get the light from outside. But I've just washed. I've just washed. I've just washed the... Uh, I've just washed the wig. I've just washed the wig. Get the comb. And let's brush it out. I am, I am tri trimming it, by the way, because it's, uh, I've got to get it ready for, you know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Chelsea says. Let's get it right. I don't know, you might be turning around and going, Michelle, what the hell are you doing? Well, I am trimming it. It's having a trim. I'll be saying the concentration is immense and you'd be right the concentration is amazing should be done. That should be doable. Oh yeah, that should be doable. Because they don't have it straight, does it? But if Jamie has it on like that, then he can just... He can just sweep it round. Like... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Struggling. Struggles a bit. Please. Um, let's just make it a bit shorter.
Got him a freaking eye now. Right, if you've got to end of uh, that air cutting scenario, then thank you very much. <laughs> it was uh, it was a joy to cut uh, Fred. That's its that's its name. It's now drying, uh, but yeah, it, it, it it's called Fred, and it is ready to come. <laughs> It's ready to come away with us so that's it it's it, it that is Fred anyway I am gonna finish this vlog thank you so much for watching and if you have got through that cutting scenario of Fred then the haircut then thank you so much and I will see you all in another vlog <laughs>